these words as a Snapchat. Boomerang with the praise and the right back. Man, we hide in the sky, no turn back. If it be our last night, leave it all here. No fear, be clear, this is your year. Let go of anything that isn't God's steer. By Zine with the dream, man, it's so clear. Yeah, so clear. And you know, wherever you go, I'ma stick close, they gon' think we a duo. Bond so tight, hug it out like a sumo. And I never think twice, you the boss of my life, no Hugo. And this world not down with us. They can try to limit faith, but it's down to us. Man, love so deep, not a game to us. When the blessing comes down, man, the praise go up, yeah. Oh, hey there, little chicken nuggets. Welcome to Grow TV. Welcome to Grow TV. Hosted by Carl. Where we have fun with our friends, talk about Jesus, and go over everything the Bible has to offer. Now, once again, welcome to Grow TV. Gotta be ready, gotta be ready. <sighs> Deep breath in, deep breath out. <sighs> oh, hey there, kiddos. I don't know how much time I have to do Grow TV. I'm training. You see, a super athlete like myself has to constantly train to keep a super human physique. <sighs> Ouch! Drill yours. Anyways, so I'm known to be the best athlete on the planet. <laughs> I gotta do whatever it takes. And that means looking at other athletes and doing what they do. So number one, Breathing techniques and mind relaxation. Let's get to it. Calmness is the spirit of relaxation. What are the things that make you relax, Carl? Puppy dogs. The color neon orange. Grizzly bear droppings. Grizzly bear tickles. Do grizzly bears tickle? I don't know, but I would love to find out one day. I like to think they do. Number two, flexibility. Every great athlete knows that being flexible will guard you against great injuries. So let's get flexible. Ah. Ooh. Oh, that's actually really tight. <laughs> Ow! Carl, are you okay? Yeah, I think so. Can you help me up? Yeah! Thank you, Cassie. Sure, so what were you doing on the floor? <sighs> well, I was training. Training? Training for what? Well, to become the greatest athlete who ever lived. Oh, right. Of course. So how's it going? Can't you see? <laughs> it's going fantastic. Oh, yeah. Obviously. All right. I'm not quite there, but I still have one more step of training. Really? What's the last step? Let me see. Check my phone. Fasting. Oh, cool. I've never done it before. Have you? Once or twice, yeah. Really? All right. Well, do you mind if I give it a try? Go ahead. All righty. <clears throat> um, what are you doing? What does it look like? I'm fasting! This is not how you fast. Yes. Oh, Cassie? Yes, it is! It's what all great athletes do! You didn't see me slowly? Pretty cool, huh? Sure. Hey, Carl, how about you sit down? I think that's enough training for the day. Yeah. Alright, I feel good. Fasting is the best. I don't want to burst your bubble, but I think fasting is a completely different thing. Oh, really? Why don't you tell me why you think it is? Fasting is when you choose not to eat or drink specific things during a certain amount of time. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure, unless you think Jesus is wrong. What? No, Jesus is never wrong. How would you say that? Well, Jesus fasted. Really? When? 
Well, it says in Mark 1 that Jesus went alone into the wilderness. That's awesome. If anyone deserves a little me time, it's Jesus. Oh, no, Carl. Jesus didn't go into the wilderness on vacation. He went there specifically to be tempted. Okay, pump the brakes. Why would Jesus do that to himself? Well, Jesus knew that doing God's work was going to be very tough. Jesus went into the wilderness to pray and gather strength for what lay ahead. Wow, I know Jesus is God's son, but man, that still had to be tough. Yep, and while Jesus was out there, he fasted. Cool, so he was only out there for like what? 20, 30 minutes? 40. Oh, 40? <laughs> That's not that bad. Days, That's... 40 days. I beg your pardon? Jesus was out there for 40 days, fasting and being tempted by the devil. Well, what did the devil tempt Jesus with? If you read Luke 4, we find out that the devil told Jesus to turn stones into bread, to jump off a really high place and force angels to catch Jesus, and even for Jesus to bow down and worship him. Those are weird things to tempt someone with. The devil knew who Jesus was and wanted to turn him against God. Of course, that didn't happen though. Isn't that incredible? But I still can't get over how he was tempted for so long. How many times did Jesus fall into his temptation or mess up? Would you believe me if I said zero times? Yeah, I would. What? What's wrong? I guess, I guess I'm a little discouraged. Why? This should be good news. Good news? How? I can't even go 40 seconds without messing up. But Jesus went 40 days without falling into a temptation. Jesus can go on forever. I can never do that. Well, of course you couldn't. You're a great person, but you're not Jesus. Carl, you see, Jesus did this to give us the perfect example on how to live. And when things get rough, he told us what to do. What did he tell us to do? Well, he told us to give our worries to God, and Jesus shows us that he can help us. Help us, huh? Even when we're being tempted? Especially when we're tempted. I know Jesus helps me when I'm tempted. Yeah, I guess you're right. Carl. Hmm, yeah. Cassie, you are right. Jesus helps me when I'm tempted. He does. He does. You're so right. Carl. Yeah. Jesse. That's good, yeah. Did you hear what I said? I did. Yeah. It's making me emotional. Yeah, he helps us. He helps us. Mm, that's good. That's good stuff. You're so right. Carl. Cassie. Oh! Ha! That's our big idea! Today's big idea is Jesus helps me when I'm tempted. So let's say it out loud on the count of three. Ready? Ready! One, two, three. Jesus helps me when I'm tempted! Yeah! So, Mr. Super Athlete, do you think you're finally finished with all your training? Not quiet. Choo choo! <laughs> choo 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 choo! Ha! Choo choo choo! Get it? Like it? I'm training? Come on, Cassie, train with me. Choo choo! Choo choo! <laughs> yeah! See you later, kids! <gasps> Thank you for watching, and tune in next week for a new episode of. Try my best to count the stars
can't fight. 